Let's hear it, I guess. And this hair is just gonna fall right off him. I would rub my belly every night and say, Dear Lord Jesus, please just let it be a beautiful little baby girl that I. Oh my gosh, I love your curls. Really? Yes. Oh. Amazing. Thanks. Mm -hmm. This is gonna sound pretentious. Mm. Don't worry. But, um,. Compliments like that always remind me of uh, Khan's uh, critique of judgment. Wow. You know, how you know he claimed of uh, universal subjectivity and basically provided a standard of judgment. You know, it really served as a foundation for modern aesthetics. Okay, well, be it as it may, I always thought that Kant misunderstood human nature. You know, personally, I prefer Ricure's theory on the creative mimesis and how it serves as a vehicle for the transformative process between the audience and the artist. Wait, what? Huh? Do you want to go to Chad's with me later? I'm bringing Jello shots. Oh my God, Jello shots! Yeah. yeah. Cooking with the chef. I'm your host, the chef. Today we're cooking a New England pheasant. Right this way. First thing you're gonna do is grab your finest serrated blade. <laughs> Shit. Oh, you think I'm not gonna come? Oh, I want you to come. Oh, I'm coming. So come already. Yeah, I'm coming right now. Better grab some towels or something, because it's gonna get messy. How can you do this to yourself? You just give up on your dreams. How can I be a stand-up comedian? I can't even stand up. Man, look at you. You may be crippled. But your sense of humor ain't. You don't know me. Damn you. So yeah, uh, I'm Trail Mix, and I've been making electronic music for the past four, four maybe the last five hours. Uh, my hit song and subsequent subgenre known as Fart Step really transcends what anybody could call dubstep. You know. I incorporate flatulence because it's something that everybody can identify with on a universal level, you know. Next you're gonna add just a dash of salt. Not too much, or else it'll f Oh! God damn it! Looks like my piece is bigger than here. Yeah, yeah, it is, isn't it? The size isn't everything. What matters is how you use it. Oh, I beg to differ. I think you're gonna know the size when I plug you with this big Oh, bit. yeah, you're gonna plug me with your big old piece, big hide man? Oh, yeah, I think that's right. I think this is the night I finally get to do it. Oh, it's not that easy, see? I think we both know that we're about to do each other. Um, what's up? Um, Party Marty. Um, been, a uh, fan of electronic music pretty much my whole life. Uh, been listening to Fart Step specifically for the better part of this afternoon. Um, and what I really like about it the most is the fact that, uh, well, specifically as an artist, I find that uh, Trail Mix really just, he sets forth a reverberation and an emanation of, it's almost like a sonic cloud of sound and smell. Your auditory senses start going and your gustation starts percolating in your brain. And before you know it, you know, you've done three quarter hits of Molly and you're with some chick you've never seen before in your life. And you realize that Fart Step was the mediator in this whole process. To me, Trail Mix is the small intestine of the electronic music scene. He 
is more than a man. What he does with his with his laptop and his butt. It's amazing. It's amazing. Just do yourself a favor, sit down, get a pair of headphones, plug it into your receiver, or your iPod, or whatever it is that you have, and listen to some fart step because it will change you. It will change you. <laughs> Pass the Cheeto! Hey, what? What? I don't even like the bun. Me neither. So it all started when I was with my roommate, you know. We were listening to some electronic music, like we usually were. And, uh, you know, we had chili that night, and he cut a huge fart. And there was something about the way the flatulence just kind of like mixed with the wobbles, you know? It's just like... Fart step transcends anything anyone's heard musically thus far. And, you know, I'm talking about on a religious level, on a corporate level, on a spiritual level. And ever since then, I just, you know, I've just been recording a lot of farts because I just can't get enough of that sound. Well, let's take a look, see how it's doing, huh? Oh, oh, oh boy. Uh, hopefully yours doesn't look anything like this. Well, heck, on the bright side, you can always... Well, tune in next week when I... Can kill myself. <laughs>